I am so Kate Winslet from the holiday right now. Pull up in the, uh, uh, wait. New thing, hot coffee. I've been a cold brew girly for years. And because it's cold and my apartment's just forever cold, I got a Keurig, Jackie gifted it to me for a clever video. And it's baby pink, it's so my vibe. This mug is from my friend Miranda. It's her birthday on Monday and I need to go shopping for her because we're all doing something together on Sunday. Miranda, what do you want for your birthday? You guys, this combo is so amazing. I did the Keurig cinnamon roll um, K-cups with that Chobani sweet cream. I just need to show you. This is such a good combo. Just thank me later. I'm not even much of a cinnamon girl, but amazing. I made oatmeal. I'm gonna go sit down and eat it. And then I wanna give you guys my thoughts on a teacher. I finished it. And my battery's dying cute. I woke up a lot later today than I'd planned because I stayed up late finishing a teacher. I look ridiculous. I'm surprised it honestly got made, but then in the last episode, I kind of almost understood what they were trying to do. I think what's so weird is that you find yourself rooting. You don't, but you find yourself kind of like love-hating this relationship. And it's so icky because you know like their ages, but here was my takeaway is also like as the viewer, the guy is 20 something. He's like 25 in the show. So it probably feels like less inappropriate to look at because if there was a real 18 year old, it would look, I think, I think a little bit cre creepy, a lot creepy, I mean. But the last episode really had me realizing like the show was there to like groom you. It was to show you that like what it's like to be groomed and like how how that kind of stuff happens and how like it's really layered Ugh. like him at, in the last episode realizing that what he had you know he was like i was just a kid like I, nothing you know it just you're like oh it took him years to like even come to terms with that which i found really crazy and really really sad for him um because the last episode is 10 years later. And you can just tell that like, he seems so sad and just messed up. And it was hard to watch a little bit for him, knowing like him. Anyway, then of course at 3 a.m. I'm going down an entire like deep Google dive of, of teacher-student relationships. Oh my god crazy on a lighter note i have two hours until therapy which is kind of an annoying window because i wanted to go to this one shopping mall it's a little bit far though so it's like the whole experience might take me two hours oh also i started and just like that i don't really want to give my opinion on it right now my opinion is just not that into it yet. Yeah. All right. I'm going to start the day. I'm going to try to run some errands, and I will see you guys when I see you. Gorgeous, gorgeous girls spend money that they shouldn't. Gorgeous girls, gorgeous girls spend money. I spent money today. I just came back from the gym. It's cold. I feel so Bridget Jones wearing a scarf in my own apartment, just looking so disheveled. We're gonna do a little haul because I went shopping, I bought a birthday present, a package came in the mail, and I went to Target. Okay, started Aritzia. Aritzia is just, it does me so dirty every time. Like, their stuff is so random. I can't explain it, but they have like 10 lives within the store. But these were basics, they actually aren't like, anything super crazy they're just basics that i already know and love i got two more of these life bra tops they're like tna wait hold on I'm watching sex in the city the original not the reboot These little bras they just the wear the place that they sit on my chest is like everything got it in brown just being just a cute little bra moment then super random but i just literally wanted a basic white tee 
and I like where it was cropped. This is actually in an extra small. Their stuff is like, the bra I'm wearing right now is from Ritzy in an extra small and it's super stretchy. So, well my couch is so dirty, dude. Like, so dirty. So then I, I went to the Americana today because they have an Aritzia there and also a bunch of other cool stores. So I went to Anthro. It's my friend's birthday in a few days, so I wanted to get her something. Actually, we can kind of package her gift. Now, they gave me this cute little gift bag. My friend is so sweet. She like always gets me such thoughtful things. So, okay, this is kind of random, but I thought it was a good gift. I got her these like Bala wrist weights um, because her and I love to go hiking together and she like, she walks everywhere. So I was like, well maybe, I didn't know she had them and these are kind of like fun and trendy. Like I feel like people really like the wrist weights. So I got her those and I got her like these little hair ties because she likes to wear her hair in braids sometimes and I thought these were kind of just like very like um, aesthetic, I guess, you know? And then I got her a mug and the mug has a cat on it. It has a, a couple cats on it um, because she is a cat girly. Let's see, is it this one? I got a mug for myself too because it was on sale. And now that I'm a hot coffee girly, I need more mugs. Like, how cute is that? I think she'll like that because she drinks hot coffee too. And she has a cat named Rainbow, so I think she'll love it. I feel like when you have a cat and when you have a dog, you just become the people that like everyone buys you things with cats on it and dogs on it, you know? Oh my God, heavy. I was out of conditioner, boring, basic. I use that stuff. I feel like people have been like hating on it recently on TikTok, so I don't know. Got another, this one's sugared cranberries candle from Target. I think this is $15, but I just burnt through an entire one of these, so I got another one. Tampons, because woman. And I got Miranda a little candle from Target. She and I always, ooh, my oven's ready. I'm gonna bake cookies. This is, I'm so Bridget Jones right now. I ordered some stuff from Set Active during the Black Friday Cyber Monday sale. If you guys watched my Set Active haul, go do it if you haven't. I am a loyal set active girl. I just, I can't explain it, but their stuff fits me really well and I really like it. Yay, this looks like everything. Okay. I got a new set. This one is just like a matching um, pants and sports bra combo in this like really pretty green color. Like so cute. This bra fits me the best. Did I get a small? Yeah. Okay, then I got another one of their like sport shorty suits in this like pretty, like kind of camel color. I'm just, not, I don't feel like I'm opening them right now. Then this was definitely like a splurge. So I'll, let me see if I like it. I also of course returned something after I bought this stuff and forgot that I chose the option to do like a gift card. So now I have $40 to them and I'm like, oh, I could have used that. This does look really cute though. Looks more highlighter on camera. Oh, that one. Really, I just like this whole day and week, I've been so self-indulgent. No, this month I should say. Okay, me as a person, I am so self-indulgent and I don't know if it's like, I'm just trying to avoid other things. So therefore I like shop, ooh. But I was happy with everything I got. Um, like look at this angel. I wanna show you guys my view. I just really quickly wanted to show you guys the set that I got from Set Active. Bought, not gifted or anything. This color was really, really cute and I like, I love like a green pop. And I felt like if you got one, like if I bought green pants, I needed to get the matching bra because otherwise it's just like green pants. This little white hoodie is from Hollister actually. And then this little vest I got from a Clever video. I think it was from like the pr premium line at like Boohoo or something. It was one of those kind of fast fashion brands, but they have like a premium line. Cause I remember this vest being like a hundred dollars, but it was clever, bought it. So anyway, that's that on that. I'm gonna go to the gym. I went last night for the first time in so long and I just walked on the treadmill for an hour and it felt amazing. So we're gonna go do that, put that energy out. And then um, I think Jake wants to go bowling with his son. So I think we'll go do that. Good morning. It is Sunday morning, it's about Brittany is meeting me for a walk. She's gonna bring her dog. No. She's getting us coffee.
coffee and then we're gonna go for a nice walk. There she is! Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Hey, fam. And then a fancy girl. Oh, Merry Christmas. Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Mm. My breath is wet. We just got like 12,000 steps in. <gasps> Let's check. Wait, do you have your phone on you? Let's check yes. our steps. All right, Britt and I have a ritual where we go to Beverly Hills and do walks in the flats with Boba. Everyone is jealous. Okay, what is it? It's the health app. Okay. Um, no, that can't be. Oh, okay, about ten thousand. Ten thousand steps. We're Haters so. will say it's Photoshop. <laughs> Hi, besties. Mmm, cute. Okay, I just went to Trader Joe's and they're selling. Oh, my back. They're selling these like skincare sets okay it comes in a pack of three I just opened it it comes with a vitamin c serum a glow mask and then a lip balm girl on tiktok was just saying that people were saying it's like the summer fridays mask and i'm a sucker for like a trader joe's dupe because their stuff is so cheap the overnight mask actually smells really good it smells almost peppermint-like. My skin is really bad. I just popped a pimple, so that's cute. It dries kind of like that tacky feeling. Okay, but I did just try the lip butter, and it's amazing. Yeah, that's upside down. Oh my god, my foot. Oh, my foot is just so much. Stuff is like so good. It's so buttery. The scent is like vanilla. It's really sweet. Oops. Sorry, I totally just picked up my skin so I look a little bit busted. Turned the Christmas tree lights on. I've been seeing so much um, multicolor light slander on online. I'm just uninterested in that point of view right now. I get it, listen, I get the classy approach is like white lights or bust, but I'm also like, I don't know, the multicolored, cause I would never do multicolored if I owned a house. Like I would never do that. Ditch my shoe, I mean my foot. I wouldn't do multicolored probably on the outside of the house. I would do white, but I wanted to create kind of like a warm feeling. And I knew that with the multicolored, it would be definitely more cozy. And then I have these like the white, obviously, um, over top the windows shoes on because I think I'm going to use my bike desk, believe it or not. Ooh, maybe I'll use my bike desk and edit some vlog footage. That could be a vibe. Oh, I have to type up a self tape too. Yes, lots to do. I never bought, I never bought Linus and I um, stockings. Oh my god, I'm also so behind on buying people Christmas presents. Shit. <laughs> that active set. I also just started to make dinner and then I immediately didn't want it. So it's just sitting there. I started to make a salad and of course I was like, I'm over this. I was just like chilling in a bowl. Butter these plants too. Minus that was just me. Start filming from this POV. You're on my heater that I never use. Okay, this is boring for you. Good evening. It is Monday, December 13th. It's about 5, no, 5.30 p.m. I wanna show you guys the lights I just put up in the kitchen. Kinda looks funny, like, from the camera, but it looks really cute, like in person. And again, don't mind my ice maker, but it looks so cute up there. It's just like a nice little addition, I thought, to go with the multicolored lights. It's radiating cozy, oh my gosh. Look at this little ham bone. Living like the dream life. I've also cleaned up my desk a little bit, although you like can't tell at all. Jake got me this vase for my birthday. Yeah. There you can 
see it better. And these peonies are so pretty. They're starting to bloom. Just like so cozy. My favorite time of the day is actually when it gets dark now because it feels so cozy and I can like turn on the Christmas tree, all the little twinkle lights come on and um, I went out last night for my friend Miranda's birthday. Happy birthday, Randy. Today's her birthday. And we had a couple drinks, so I was a little bit of like a waste of space today. Just um, slept in, like didn't get a ton done. But I'm shooting for Clever tomorrow, so I won't have time. So maybe I'll put on a little bit of makeup and like do something like that tonight. So I wanna sign off on this vlog and I will make sure to film tomorrow at Clever and give you guys some fun behind the scenes at Clever tomorrow. And then I've been so far so good at posting to Mondays and Thursdays. So I'm gonna keep doing that. And I think what I'll do next is like a full blown apartment tour. Maybe not like the next video, but I think I'm gonna film, like set up and film an apartment tour because I love my apartment. It's something I'm like super passionate about and I just, it's like my cozy safe space. So yeah, if you guys wanna see that, please let me know in the comments below and I will expedite filming that. And thank you for just hanging out with me and, and we're having fun. Love you guys, bye.